Hello everyone, welcome back with an RSPS video and today we are back on one of my favorite Brewski private servers of all time, Ike of RSPS. And today, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be announcing the re-release of this server. I'm super, super excited and I hope you guys are as well. We're going to be showcasing a bunch of new features this guys release. We're going to showcase the most crazy release competitions I've seen and we're also going to be hosting a very lovely giveaway. First things first, $50 to $5. Lucky people in total, $10 each. All you have to do for that is like the video, comment, your name down below, and be subscribed to my channel. And of course, if you guys are not part of iCurve yet, make sure to be joining with the links down below. Make sure to register your accounts on the forums. Make sure to join the Discord. And of course, get excited for this crazy release. Here we are on the official forums of iCurve, aka iCurve 2, right here. As we can see in the middle, we have the countdown timer, 4 days and 32 minutes until the server releases this is friday of course 9th of december 6 p.m gmt 10 a.m pst as we can see right here but honestly the best to do is register your account on the forums check the countdown on the website and then you guys will know exactly when the server is going to be releasing as we can all see right off the bat release info with huge prices iphone 14s and this is not just one that's freaking plural you see that Jesus Christ. Let's get into it. Let's get really quick through the announcement right here. First things first, obviously the release date. Second of all, important to mention is that you guys will be not taking anything from of 1 to of 2. This is important to mention. So as he's mentioning as well right here. Over a year ago, we've begun working on of 2. With that said, this will be a completely fresh game. This does unfortunately mean that for all progress and achievements from the first game will be lost and not carry over to the second game. This is very important. And um, yeah, will I be able to keep my username from of one right here? Yes, however, you will need to log in the forum between now and the release. So yeah, the earlier you guys register your account, the better, okay? That's what I'm saying. Go to the forums, links down below, register your account so you guys will be able to secure your IGN. All right, now we go into the juicy part. What prizes can be won? Firstly, we'll be giving away tons of old screen GP in our Discord, so join that for some easy giveaways. That is actually very true. In the giveaway section on Discord, you guys only have to react by clicking on one little thing to enter hundreds of millions of old school RuneScape GP giveaways. As you can see as well right here, literally just click on this bad boy, you can see 600 entries, so you guys get the idea how freaking hype this is going to be. Again, to join the Discord, first link in the description, of course, ladies and gentlemen. And yeah, you're also going to be giving away five iPhone 14s. That is absolute insane. How can you win this question mark? Well, the first player to achieve a completion escape on a regular account mode is going to be winning an iPhone. That's actually very, very awesome. I think this is going to be where the most people will be competing on. The first player to achieve a completion escape with a realistic account right here. Then we have the first player to achieve a completion escape on an Iron Man account. Hardcore also counts. Group Iron Man does not count. First player to achieve a comp cape on an Elite Iron Man account. And the first first person to a uh, group to achieve 4 billion XP will receive $100 PayPal for each member. That isn't an iPhone, obviously. But yeah, that is absolute insane. If you don't want iPhone 14, you can also be credit your iCov account. It's that will send you the equivalent month free PayPal. So I absolute insane. I don't know how much an iPhone 14 is, but I think it's a lot over 1K. So I 5,000 or six or 7,000, I don't even know how much these are worth to be honest, in freaking release competitions to you guys. So if you guys want to grind something for freaking winter time, Christmas time, the biggest hype of the year, now is the time to join Icof, ladies and gentlemen. And myself, I gotta be grinding the shit out of this game. This is so nostalgic for me. This game is so fucking amazing. And I'm gonna be showcasing a couple of changes they've done on their server, some new features and everything in a second after we go through all of these announcements. Last part of this announcement right here is the content release on, I on ICOF. So, first things first, after one week, Champions of Zarek is going to be releasing with a bunch of competitions as well. First things first, the first player to get an Omelette pad receives $100 PayPal or $150 ICOF. First player to get a unique item, $100 PayPal or ICOF credits. So, I on top of all the freaking iPhones you guys will have a chance to win, you have a bunch of freaking weekly competitions you can enter as well for even more rewards. First person, fastest solo after one week, receives $200 PayPal or $300 ICOF credit. The group with the fastest time after one week, $50 PayPal or $100 credit, limited to a max of 10 people. First person with the most cost completion after one week will receive $100 PayPal or $150 ICOF credit. Week two, 
T.O.B. The first player to get little Zeke pad receives $100 or $150 like of credits. First player to get a unique item, $100 or $150. The first group with the fastest time after one week will receive $50 each or $100 like of credits up to 10 people. The person with the most C.O.B. completion after one week is going to get as well $100 paper or $150 in like of credit. Week 3 is going to be Nightmare. The first player to get a little nightmare pack will receive $100, $150 in Ike of Credits. They actually said how much they actually give it away. It's crazy. But anyway, first player to get a unique item, $100, PayPal, $150, Ike of Credits. The group with the fast time after one week, again, up to 10 people, 50 and 100. Absolute insane. And week four, Boss Gauntlet's going to be released. The first player to get the new pack will receive $100 or 150 credits. And um, yeah. That's absolutely insane. What a change on iCov 2 question mark. Here's some updates and changes we've made since iCov 1. We'll try to go as quick as, as quickly as possible through it. It's so much, it's actually freaking insane. I'm just going to read through the main uh, titans very quick. So right, let's start right here. Town board. The game of God War has been replaced with a town board right there. Pat perks. That's insane. Packs can now hold up to five different packs depending on how hard the pack is to obtain. Absolute awesome. To unlock a perk of your pet, uh, bring some pet tokens to Probita. These tokens can be received from the reworked voting shop or through the Tombot reward shop. That's actually very, very creative and cool. I love it. Economy. We've made some changes to reduce the amount of gold that comes into the game. All right. That's very nice. Economy changes. Market changes. Gambling changes. Oh, yes. A new gambling area has been Edit. Right. Gambling is going to be a huge content piece on iCov. So all the gambling artists are there, including myself, bro. We're going to have a freaking insane time on iCov. So right, we're definitely looking forward to that. Skills now. Okay. Dungeoneering. We've reworked Dungeoneering. So what it used to be before EOC. Okay. So right, a huge ass Dungeoneering update. Definitely very, very OP. And I would definitely recommend to grind uh, Dungeoneering on iCov. was always super fun since day one. Next up, we have agility change, as we can see right here. All curses now give agility tickets, okay? Farming changes, as we can see right here. Construction, slayer changes. Slayer is also very important, of course. All type of slayer tasks now give regular slayer points. Wilderness slayer points have been removed, okay? To compensate, wildy dance will give more regular slayer points instead. Cool. And next, your loot table for slayer caskets. Nice. Imbued hearts are now announced as a rare drop. Very, very nice. Tier thing, summoning changes, magic changes as well. So as you can see, they've literally reworked the entire freaking thing. It's actually crazy. Next up, we got mini games. Riot Wars has been removed. Rest in peace. I actually enjoyed this one a lot back in the day. Pyramid Plunder has been removed as well. Pass control sets are now restored after every game. It should now be possible to do it as a solo player as well. Okay. New mini games. Winter Town has been added. Temporos has been added. Blast Furnace has been added. Evil Trees. Okay, that one has been added as well. Vines can now randomly spawn. And knock players aside. Ooh, very cool. Elite Barrows has been added. Gauntlet has been added. That's actually very cool. You can now grind weapons upgrades into shots. It is now unsafe for armor. So this is actually an update. It's not been added in the mini game, but a couple of changes right here. Uh, Inferno changes, rage changes. As you can see right here, again, all the details you guys can check out yourself. I'm going to be linking this thread as well in the description. Tournaments has been reworked. Uh, Warrior Skilled has been adjusted as well. And then we go into a bunch of combat updates they've been working on. That's actually insane. Then we have Wilderness updates right here. Death update. And then we go into a bunch of bosses, as you can see right here. Uh, crazy amount of updates as well on them. Items and other changes. Jesus freaking Christ. There's been so much these guys have been working on. I'm already so, so excited. I can't wait until these four days are over. So we can start, finally, the grind. Here we are, ladies and gentlemen, back in-game. Important to mention again, $50 to 5 lucky winners. Like the video, comment, check your name down below, and be subscribed to my channel. I'm not going to be showcasing too much in-game since the video is already getting quite long. I'm going to be doing a proper server to a video probably on the weekend after the release. I'm super excited for that one. Right now, I would like to mention a couple of things in-game. Uh, things are still subject to change before the launch. So this right here is just the beta we're playing. There's going to be changes towards this right here. That's important to mention. Just want to go really quick through the teleports. You guys can have a look into that. Wow, this is so nostalgic for me. And then you guys will be able to see all the content the servers offer right here. So we're going to go really quick through all the different teleports. So we got the bunch of training teleports right here. 
Then we have the different Slayer teleports right here. Important to mention also, if you guys have a specific favorite task, for example, you are a huge fan of, I don't freaking know, let, let's just pretend of the strike from the jungle right here. You can press on this little heart and it will go right here into the favorite sword. So yeah, Slayer teleports, I have crazy amount of these. Then we go into the lovely um, Bossin. Abyssal Sire, Ancient Vivens, Banner Savitar, Barrel Chest, Borg. Cyberus, Corporal Beast, Demonic Gorillas, Giant Maw, Glaciers, Godwars Dungeon, Ice Demon, Calphite Queen, King Black Dragon, Kraken, Nex is also going to be part of Ikov, as well as all its items. Nightmare, Nomad, Phoenix, Queen Black Dragon as well. Jesus Christ, that's a nice one. Fragment of Siren, Scoteaser, Tormented Demons, Walketh, Xampu, Zulcano, and Zara. So I'm not even sure if there's anything missing, to be honest. Then we got a shit ton of scaling teleports, so people who love to skill, this is the server to play, ladies and gentlemen, because there is so much variety of skill, and everything you want and you need to skill, content-wise, will be on here. Mini games, we got Barrows, Blast Fornage, Castle Wars, Champion Challenge, as we can see right here, that requires a scroll, very, very nice, I remember that was a very nice achievement as well for that one. Duel Arena, Fight Caves, Fight Pits, F2P Arena, Gauntlet, Inferno, Larry's Penguin Hunted, uh, last man standing, party room, oh nice, that is actually very cool, they have a party room as well. Pass control, rates 1, 2 and 3 as well, holy freaking moly, rate 3 as well included on here. Soul Wars, Tears of Gothics, Temperus, Tournament, Warrior Skill, Winter Tot and Zulcano. Next on the list we have Wilderness Teleports, as you can see right here, a, a big variety of content as well on here and finally City Teleports and Michelinia ones. The one I want to show you right here is definitely the gambling area, which I haven't seen personally yet. So I'm super excited to see it. Wow, wow, holy shit. This is crazy. What a huge zone this is. So again, I'm not 100% sure how it's going to be looking on day of release, but like just the place they've picked, I'm quite sure this will be it. Bro, it's massive. And I can see this filled up with so many people. And of course, one of the biggest content pieces in life as well, the achievements you guys want to go ahead and grind that you guys can find right here as well. And the main tab, as you can see right here, quest completed, achievements completed, town boards completed, collection locks, all of it, good stuff is in here as well. And I think that's a perfect wrap up right here. So I just locked in as well. Man, this guy is probably the craziest gambler on ICO. So I'm definitely looking forward to his content as well. And a lot of YouTubers will be doing content. So definitely make sure we're checking out their contents as well. They will be hosting some nice giveaways as well. So make sure to be signing up on them as well. Again, like the video, comment, share, and give me name down below and be on my channel. Five people is a lot of winners. So chance you guys will be walking away with a $10 for on release will be quite big. The Winners will be announced on the video on Friday, so make sure to be checking that one out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video right here. The hype is real. I'm so looking forward to iCurve's toy. Let me know down below how you guys feel about this release right here and how freaking crazy it's going to be. Thank you so much for tuning in, everybody. I love you all. Have a good one. Enjoy the release of iCurve's 2. I'll see you all online, and peace out.